Hi everyone, it's me Amy and I have a new video for you. It's currently um, 2.30ish and before I go to bed I just wanted to make a video because I know it's been a hot minute since I've made one and I'm sorry for that. I've been super busy. I'm getting married pretty soon and I've been getting decluttering, cleaning, getting rid of a lot of things and um, so yeah, I just figured I'd hop on here for a few minutes and I wanted to um, show you my collections that I've had over the years. The year 2010 was a big year for collecting for me. Um, not only was that the, well I started collecting lip balls in 2009, but 2010 was when it really kicked off. Um, but that wasn't the only thing I bought that I started collecting. Um, I collected a few interesting different things over the years, starting in really 2009, but 2010 was like a big, the biggest collection year for me. So let's get started. The one thing I did collect, I don't really collect anymore, I don't really have anything to show you, was, um, you know those quarter machines that they have at like the grocery store and stuff, you put a quarter and then you get like a little toy or whatever? I collected a lot of those. But I don't really have, unfortunately, I don't really have anything left of that collection. But um, another thing I did collect from those quarter machines was, were bouncy balls. Oh, of course, a lot of these weren't from bound, bound um, were from the quarter machines like this one that has little things in it that oh, I guess they still move around. It looks like they were stuck in there. This one wasn't from a quarter machine, I don't believe. It looks like a soccer ball. It's pretty cool. That's kind of, I'm not going to take them out and show you individually because that would take too long. I tried to film this video last night, but um, YouTube told me they couldn't upload it because it was too long. And it was only like 17 minutes long, so do better, YouTube. Um, anyway, I didn't really collect these per se, but I used to be into jewelry making. I wasn't very good at it. So it's kind of a short-lived hobby, but um, here's some beads that I still have. Um, yeah, again, I didn't really collect beads per se, but um, I guess I kind of did. I collect. I didn't really think I collected coffee mugs, and I'm not gonna show you all of them because again, that would take too long. But this is one my mom got me. Unfortunately, I broke it. But I didn't want to get rid of it, so she glued it back together for me. It's was the iconic Spongebob meme. What's funnier than 24? 25. <laughs> that was one of my presents for my 25th birthday. And this is a collection I still have a lot of. It's keychains. These are all my keychains. Um, these are like my country concert keychains that I have. and so I'll show, There's not too many of them, so I'll show you. All right, um, it's Brad Paisley from his tour H2O2 Water Milder from 2011, I think. Another Brad Paisley keychain from 2014, I think, or 2013, it was one of the two. Miranda Lambert, I got that from the concert she did with Brad in 2012 at Regular Field. I got this at Brad's Regular Field show, the Virtual Reality Tour, 2012. As you can see, I'm a huge fan. I even have this shirt right now <laughs> of Brad Paisley. Um, I have done a few videos on him on my channel if you want to check it out. Brad Paisley H2O Frozen Over Tour. I think that was 2010 or 2011 or 2010. It was like the winter months. I know. Because I saw him on the H2O Tour. Like the, it was just called the H2O Tour. So that must have been the winter part of it, but anyway. And my last country one is Keith Urban. Um, it's from his album Get Closer that came out in 2010, but I remember that in 2012. All right, and last but not least, this is really the only collection I do nowadays. Um, and here I have some of my lip balms. I think there's only like 30-ish in here. I couldn't go through all my lip balms to show you because it would take um, like four to six business days. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's in a, this is a Rapunzel purse I have. And I'm going to show you the flavors. I'll go through them kind of quickly because there's a lot of them. 
Yes. Delight Naturals Fruity Rebel. Cherry Pit Crust Banana Pudding. Strawberry Shortcake by um, Cherry Pit Crafts. They don't do lip balms anymore. I'm sad because they were very good lip balms. Tiramisu by Delight Naturals. I love Delight, Na Delight Naturals so much. I cannot even know. Chocolate Mousse by Cherry Pit Crafts. Sour Sweets, Cherry, or not Cherry Pit Crafts, um, Delight Naturals. These are mainly going to be Cherry Pit Crafts and Delight Naturals, I think. Lip Zest, Southern Sweet Tea. Melon by Cherry Pit Crafts. Red Delicious Apple, Cherry Pit Crafts. Cherry Pit Crafts, uh, Raspberry Fluff. Found Popsicle by uh, Lip Zest. Cherry Pit Crafts, Chocolate Lava Cake. Um, Lip Zest, Grilled Corn. Um, Cherry Pit Crafts, Cucumber Melon. It does smell a lot like the Bath and Body Works scent. Cherry Pit Crafts Christmas Cookies. It's like those, that one smells like the Danish cookies in Littleton. Cinnamon Gummy Bear. Uh, Cherry Pit Crafts Lemon Fluff. Sweet Barbecue Sauce by Lip Zest. This one's so good. Coffee by Cherry Pit Crafts. Pistachio Ice Cream by Cherry Pit Crafts. Blueberry Pie by Lip Sauce. Black Forest Cake by Cherry Pit Crafts. Carrot Cake by Delight Naturals. Key Lime Pie by Delight Naturals. Creme Brulee by Delight Naturals with a little sticker on it. Not sure where it came from. Rocky Road by Cherry Pit Crafts. Cream Soda by Delight Naturals. Fruit Kebab by Lip Zest. Juicy Grape by Cherry Pit Crafts. Utah Honey by Delight Naturals. Let's see. We're reaching the end, I promise. Strawberry Lemonade by Cherry Pit Crafts. Wasabi by Delight Naturals and Rose Petal by Delight Naturals. Okay, yeah, that makes sure it was the end of it. All right, and that's all the lip balms I have in there. Um, and yeah, that was uh, my the portion of the lip balms of this video. Um, in total, I have forty three hundred twenty five or four thousand three hundred twenty five lip balms. I'm hoping by the end of year I can reach um, five thousand. Unfortunately, it's already in May and it's not looking good, but I mean, if I don't reach it, it is what it is. But, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed my collector's edition of this video. Um, if you did, please give a big thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel. And I hope you have a great night and I hope you have a, you've had a great month of May and I hope you have a great month of June and I hope to talk to you soon. Bye guys.